Hi guys, my friend Peppa Pig continues. Yes, New York. New York. <laughs> New friend. Continue. New friend. Continue. New friend. Continue. New friend. Continue. New. Let us start. First off, choose what kind of clothes you will wear. Great! Now choose the animal you want to be. Good choice! What colour do you want to be? Would you like to wear glasses? Do you want to wear a hat? Well done! Now, if you want to start playing, choose yes. Welcome to Peppa Pig's Town. You'll have a lot of fun here. We're going to meet Peppa in a moment, but first, let's try walking. Use the stick to move around. What a nice flower. Why don't you get close to it? Now press a button to touch it. Remember to use this button when it appears on the screen. The butterfly is flying away. Let's follow it. What's that? There's a fence blocking the way. Not to worry, you can use the same button to open the gate. Sometimes you will need to move things out of the way to keep going. Remember to use this button when it appears on the screen. Oh, hello! Welcome to the town. Where are you going, little one? To talk to Miss Rabbit, walk up to her and press the action button. Are you going to see Peppa? She's just up the hill. Keep walking and you'll be there in a minute. Bye now. Well done. You've learned how to... A new friend has come to visit Peppa. How exciting! <laughs> oh, goody, you're here! Welcome! We're going to have a lovely time! You're here, you're here! We're going to have the best day ever! My room. Do you like it? 
I have lots of toys in the basket. Hello there. What are you two up to in here? Mummy, Mummy! We're playing with the toys in my basket. I think George would like to play with you too. Impossible. George, I'm busy with my new friend. Ooh. Peppa, I'm sure you can all play together, the three of you. Why don't you play tag? How do you play tag? You have to chase each other, and when you catch someone, they're it. OK. You're it. <laughs> OK, then. I'll leave you to it. Why don't we go visit my granny and grandpa? The house is just ahead. Let's keep walking this way. This is Granny and Grandpa Pig's house. Pepper always has a great time here. <coughs> Polly Parrot imitates everything you do. Why don't you try jumping or making a sound? around here? Yes, Granny. She just left. Oh, my. That won't do at all. Peppa, can you and your friend help me find the missing chickens? I don't think they will have gone very far. Yes, yes, Granny. We will find them. It seems Granny's chickens have left their coop. Why don't you help her by bringing all of the chickens back? chickens left. Bye. 
the last one. All of the chickens are safe and sound now, Not thanks me. to you. Yuck! Grandpa, what is this for? Oh, that is called compost. It's a special muck that I use to fertilize the veggies. Be careful, though. It's very smelly. What does fertilize mean, Grandpa? It means it will help them grow bigger and be even more delicious. Why don't you try putting some in this patch of land? Oh, ho! great job. Now the plants will grow strong and tall. Can we go? Grandpa, what are you doing? I'm planting seeds so that new plants will grow in the garden. Do you want to help me? Yes, please. What do we have to do? Well, for starters, pick one of the plants in the garden and grab a seed from it. Any plant? Yes, Peppa. Whichever you prefer. Ooh, but I don't know which one to pick. I know. Why don't you help me pick? Help Pepper and Grandpa grow a new plant in the garden. Go to one of the plants and pick up a seed. Did you grab a seed? Well done. Now come back and plant it here. Let's go this way. <laughs> <laughs> First, make a little hole. Now put the seed in. Cover it with earth and water it. And then go slow. Guys. Butter it. Fantastic! Butter it. Now a new plant Butter will it. grow here. It. Will it take a long time, Grandpa? Oh, yes. Plants grow very slowly. Make sure to come back every once in a while to see how much the plant has grown. Good job. You have planted a new seed in Grandpa's garden. Make sure to come back here every once in a while to see the plants grow. Hello, Peppa. Hello, Peppa's friend. Hello, Grandpa. Peppa, I think we're going to get hungry while we wait for the vegetables to grow. Egg. Would you like Egg. to have a meal? Mm. Yes. Egg. Please. Eggs. Splendid. Egg. Then why don't you go fetch some eggs from Granny Pig's coop and bring them to the kitchen? Okay. Grandpa Pig wants you to get some eggs from the chicken coop and take them to the kitchen so he and Granny Pig can cook you a meal. First, let's go to the chicken coop. This way. <laughs> Hello, children. Hello, Granny. Have you come to check on the chickens? No, no, Granny. Grandpa has sent us to get eggs so we can cook a yummy meal. I see. Why don't you take them yourself? Check inside the little house. Meh. <laughs> Chicken. Ah, I see you've got some eggs. Now, why don't you take them to the kitchen? I'll go ahead and wait for you there. 
Granny and Grandpa Pig are waiting for you in the kitchen. Better not make them wait too long. delicious hard-boiled eggs for you two. Why don't you sit at the table? Mmm, smells delicious. Enjoy your meal, everyone. It's very good. I'm glad you like it, Peppa. Ah, it's very good. I'm sorry, Polly. I don't think these would be good for you. It's very good! Hello, children. Have you come to check on my chickens? Are they all right, Granny Pig? They're more than all right, Peppa. Because you and your friend brought them back to the coop, their eggs have now hatched. And we have little chicks. <gasps> little chicks? Yes. Do you want to see them? Yes, please, Granny. Show us the little chicks. Take a look for yourselves. They're sleeping in their little house right now. Go ahead. Chick singing cheek cheek cheek. I like to pick up food with my beak beak beak. I just love the yellow head and strong on my bed and I jump up and down singing cheek cheek cheek. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, children. Are you having fun? Yes, Grandpa. We're having a lot of fun. I wonder, do you like aeroplanes? Yes, yes. Fantastic. Why don't you come with me, then? All right. Where are we going, Grandpa? You'll see. Just a moment now. Here we are. Now wait here just a second. Oh dear, where did I put it? Ah, here it is. Ooh. What is this, Grandpa? It's a toy aeroplane. Watch. Wow, Grandpa. Pig has built a toy aeroplane. Why don't you try a loop the loop? Wow. 
How about a tour around the house? Grandpa loved toy aeroplanes. Everybody loves toy aeroplanes. Hello, Mr. Bull. What is going on here? Hello, family. Hello, children. We are in the middle of doing some repairs on this road. What happened to the old road? There were some bumps caused by the tree's roots nearby, which made it dangerous to drive through. Not to worry. Mr. Rhinoceros and I will take care of it. We'll let you get on with it. Is there a way to go through? Ho oh, ho, yes! You can drive right by the road. Be careful. Okay. Thank you very much. Goodbye, Mr. Bull. Goodbye, Mr. Rhinoceros. Thank you for fixing the road. have arrived. But, Grandpa, Granny, where is all the sand? Well, this is a rocky beach. So instead of sand, it's full of rocks. Oh, we wanted to build sand castles. What are we going to do? Don't worry. There are plenty of fun things to do on this rocky beach. If you look around, you will find pools of water between the rocks. It's fun to see what's in them. That's right. When the sea goes out, it always leaves behind something special in the rock pools. Really? What kind of things are we going to find? Why don't you and your friend have a look in the rock pools and put what you find in the bucket? Take a look in the rock pools on the beach and show Granny and Grandpa Pig the things you find. Shiny. It's a coin. Perhaps it once belonged to a pirate. Whoa! I love pirates. I found a crab in the rock pool. Crabs love to hide in rock pools. Be careful not to get your finger pinched. Oh no! Don't be a naughty crab. Did you know that if you put a shell to your ear, you can hear the sea? Really? Wow! Congratulations! You have found all the things in the rock pools and have learned a lot about rocky beaches.
enjoying your time with Granny and Grandpa Pig? Yes, Mummy! <laughs> <laughs> That's great. Now how about we find a spot on the sand to sit down? This place seems like a nice spot. Daddy Pig, we were going to have a swim together. <laughs> I know what we can do. Can we cover him up with sand, Mummy? <laughs> it would be very funny. That would be funny. OK, then. But be careful not to wake him up. Daddy Pig has fallen asleep on the beach. And Peppa wants to cover him up in sand. Can you take a spade and help her? Hurry, hurry! Up before he wakes up. Hurry, hurry! Let's cover him up before he wakes up. Oh no! I think that's enough. Look, Mummy, Daddy's all covered in sand. <laughs> Look at him. You did a great job, you two. Uh, 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 that was a good nap. Ooh. Uh, what's this? Oh, I see what's going on. Sorry to have woken you up, Daddy. Oh, that's all right. I must say, it feels very comfortable to be all covered in sand. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Let's make a sand castle. First, put sand in your bucket. Turn your bucket over and then lift it off. Ta-da! And now, you can knock it down. I love sandcastles. Wait a minute. You can't go in like this. Oh, all right. Hello, Mr. Bull. What is going on here? 
Hello, family. Hello, children. We are in the middle of doing some repairs on this road. What happened to the old road? There were some bumps caused by the tree's roots nearby, which made it dangerous to drive through. Not to worry. Mr. Rhinoceros and I will take care of it. We'll let you get on with it. Is there a way to go through? Oh, yes. You can drive right by the road. Be careful. Okay. Thank you very much. Goodbye, Mr. Bull. Goodbye, Mr. Rhinoceros. Thank you for fixing the road. Parents' house. This is Granny and Grandpa Pig's house. Pepper always has a great time here. Would you like to go to the beach? Grandpa could take us in his car. Polly Parrot imitates everything you do. Why don't you try jumping or making a sound? friends to Windy Castle. Windy Castle has a very tall tower. We'll get a view of the whole town. You'll see. Hooray! Dinosaur! No, George. I'm afraid there are no dinosaurs up there. Dinosaur! But you can take Mr. Dinosaur with you. Dinosaur! All right, then. Why don't you two go and wait for us in the car while we finish getting ready? Right away! Let's go to the car. Daddy will drive us to Windy Castle. have arrived with Pepper and her family at Windy Castle. Wow! I've never seen such a big castle. Come on, let's go inside. The view from the top is amazing. You'll see. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Looking through the telescope makes everything seem closer. Why don't you take some time to look around? Do you recognize this? It's our house. Oh, yes, Daddy. I can see my bedroom window from here. In loss. In loss, Dad. Potato City. Can we go, Mummy, please? Of course. Not now, though. We're enjoying Windy Castle today. The playgroup. No one's there, though, because it's not playgroup time. 
And there's Snowy Mountain. The view is fantastic. But it seems to be very cold up there. We found the museum. I love the museum. Dinosaur. <laughs> and there's Snowy Mountain. The view is fantastic. But it seems to be very cold up there. We found the museum. I love the museum. Dinosaur. <laughs> look, look. I can see Miss Rabbit in her hot air balloon. She must be waiting to take someone to Snowy Mountain. Oh, today would be a perfect day to go to the beach. That looks like Granny and Grandpa's house. And look, Granny and Grandpa are outside. Do you think they can see us? <laughs> I don't think so, Peppa. We're very far away from them. Mummy! Daddy! Can we come back to Windy Castle soon? Of course, Peppa. I'm glad you had a good time looking through the telescope. I knew you would love it. Windy Castle is a lot of fun. Using the telescope from the top, you can spot many places. Even some that are very far away.